Hello everyone. This video will walk you through how the ATL file can be customized. I'm Anju, a developer in Control Design Automation. So let's get started. An ATL file is a special description file that defines the implementation of an ECU. The information in an ATL file allows an XCP client to communicate with a server module via an XCP connection. The formatted text file contains event and measurement definitions and other configuration information used for acquiring and stimulating data and to perform other functions. This video will focus on how to customize the sections of the A2 file, such as characteristics, measurements, compu methods, etc. Open a Simulink model and use the Simulink Coder app to go to code perspective. Build the model to generate the code. Once the build is done, we can now customize the different fields for the ATL file. To do this, first create an object from coder.asapto.getECU descriptions. The object created has the methods add, delete, find, get, and set. So now let me walk you through each of these methods. The find method can be used to find the elements of a given category. For example, if you want to find all the characteristics that are to be populated, use find description object characteristic. The find method will also enable you to filter the set by an attribute. For example, to find all characteristics of type curve, you would use find description object and type as curve. So now let's see how you could view all the properties of a specific element. This could be done using the get method. For example, let's take the example of the characteristic external temperature. To the view the properties, use get, description object, characteristics and external temperature. This will give you all the ASAP2 properties for the element. As you can see here, the element is defined in degree Celsius. The ESAP2 file when loaded into a calibration tool would give the element with temperature in degree Celsius. Wondering if it's possible to change the view on the calibration tool to have it in Kelvin instead of in Celsius? Yes, it is. On the ATL file, the interpretation is controlled by the Compu method. So now let's define a new Compu method to convert Celsius to Kelvin. To do this, create an object out of coder.asapto.compute method, provide the name, conversion type, coefficients, and the unit. Now, the add method can be used to add this newly created compute method to the asapto file. This compute method created now has to be associated with the element. Use set description object category element name and the property to be set and its value. Now, let's generate the ADL file. Use custom issue description and pass in the description object. In the ADL file, we can now see that the element is associated with the newly created compu method and you also have the new compu method definition. The ASAP2 file, when loaded into a calibration tool, would give the temperature in Kelvin. Now, if you would like to delete an element from the ATL file, you could use the delete method. For example, let's say we would like to remove the characteristic external temperature. We would use delete description object characteristic and external temperature. Now, regenerate the ATL file and the ATL file would not have the element. You could also customize the other sections of the ATL file, and for more information, you could refer to the documentation. So this brings us to the end of the video. Thank you.